This is your boy Mad Dog, and this is the Dude Motor Vlog. We're going to do a little off-roading today on the bike. So, here we go. If you'd like to uh, subscribe, like the channel, or leave a comment, much appreciated. It's a new channel, everything helps out. Try to build the channel up a little bit, so, so we can do more of this kind of stuff. I found a little trail here. Maybe we'll go down here and see if there's anything down here. It doesn't look like it's too highly traveled. Or maybe this was an old oil well or something. Kind of has that feel. You see there's an opening out here? Hope it was not an oil well. If it is, it'll dead end. That was like finding new trails, but I think that's a dead end. I don't see anything else back in here. Oh, there's a lot of weed out here. Someone tore it all up doing donuts out here. Well, I guess that was a bust. Man, pickers got me right in the neck back there. I guess we'll go down here. There's a trail here. Maybe we'll go down here. Ah, this is one horses go down. That'll be rougher than shit. Anytime they let horses go down, these things are rough. horses come down these trails. They should have separate trails that are just for horses. This man on a motorcycle or even a pickup truck or anything, it beats you up from riding through where the horses go. Trying to do a power wheelie there, and I started to, then the SN washed out on me. So dry and dusty. Boy. That sand is soft, boy. It needs the rain. When you don't get no rain, this sand is soft. Especially with universal tires. As people come through here with horses and they come through with pickup trucks and they hop the tires all the way through it. So it's rougher than shit. So you can see where they spun the tires the whole way through that. Instead of picking up the pace and going fast enough that they could go through it without spinning the tires, well, they'll go slow then gas it in the middle of the sand when they realize they're going too slow and spin the tires all the way up it. You can't fix stupid. That's some nice shit for you. Oh, well, it kicked pretty good on that one. I went to go stand up and it still smacked me in the ass. Looks like it's all washed out here. Oh. Oh. I guess 40 miles an hour is too fast to be hitting whippy doos with this bike. I guess now I do. You got a lot for my fringe, you're a little slow. Is 
Man, so I don't really like coming over those hills quite that fast because you see it was washed out there. So I just nailed it and kind of did a wheelie over it. That could have been bad if you come over that and didn't really know what to do and just like panic. You would definitely go over the handlebars, but I know what to do. You just lean back and gas it and do a wheelie over it. That's the only choice you really got. If you want to stay on the bike, that is. I'm sure on the GoPro this uh, looks like it's flat land, but these are all hills. I mean, they're not super steep or anything, but they're still big enough that people are getting stuck on them. You know, in pickup trucks and stuff. That looks like we got a road here. No sign or anything. That'd be too much to ask. I guess the trail turns. washed out too but it had a little gravel on it so it wasn't too bad if it was sand it would have been could have been a problem oh that was a root oh I think there's a hill back there let me turn around I think there was It looks like someone had a tractor back in here or something. Oh yeah, there's a sand hill in here. Oh, it don't look that bad. I'm sure it looks like people got stuck at the top. I can see there's a big hole up there from here.